Hi there, Brendan from Homestead Survival Gardens, and today we're planting onions. And uh, this is the first time I'm planting them from seeds. I am planting onions from seeds, and uh, this is part of my succession garden plan to keep planting in the fall and replace summer garden plants and get a second crop. Um, it, it, they only cost a penny a piece. And let me show you. This is what I use. I get these high mowing seeds and they're little pellets. Pellets. So easy to plant, these onions. This is called the talon onion. I planted them in these type of trays, like a 50 or 72 cell tray. But you have to plant them in the summer. So these are planted on 7 11 22. So I planted these on 7 11 22, and they were really hard to keep going in the hot summer, but I got them going. They're only a penny a piece. And the reason I'm planting them in the fall is because they could take the cold, even though it does get a little cold over here, believe it or not. You could even plant them in upstate New York if you cover them. But they like the cold, they can handle the cold, and they don't like the heat. So if you plant these too late in the spring and you get into the summer, they're gonna dry up. This has happened to me so many times. It took me a long time to get a successful onion crop uh, and it, you have to keep them moist all the time. So if you plant it in the fall, they'll have all the moisture from the winter and then they'll be growing quickly in the spring. So this is how I plant them. So this bed was prepared with compost, planted about three inches apart. And these are yellow, they're called talon. Uh, onions and they're about they're three inch onions and they will I'm gonna plant about three inches apart a lot of people plant them one inch apart and then thin them to three but three is fine to start with these I don't I'm not concerned about thinning because I really don't have all that many look at these babies look at the roots yep look plant them in you want to have it the crown the top where the bulb is gonna be about one inch below the ground and this is in a good uh, drainage, it's got a combination of compost and uh, topsoil mixed in three inches apart. Look at that, look at this, look at what's in there. Look at that beautiful compost with the soil. It's, a, it's good to mix the compost with the soil. You can't go compost straight, you can, but it's not as effective. All right, here we go. I'm going to plant this row, it's October 14th. And by June, I'm expecting to get big, fat onions. And by the way, pests don't like onions and garlic in the Allen family. In fact, we're going to probably make a spray out of onions, uh, onions or garlic and spray them on the carrot tops because we have a lot of rabbits around here. And we haven't had them feast on them yet, but it's good to have a natural protection for them. Okay, Brendan Reardon, Homestead Survival Gardens. What can I do?